Hello, this is Damian Alomar with ASGVIS, and this tutorial is about adding rectangular lights. Our scene we have here is the same three toys uh, that we've had before with the materials applied, and our options are for the most part the same, although I do have the GI, the skylight, disabled. Uh, so all the light that's in the scene is going to be from the rectangular light we are going to add. I also have uh, show calculation phase disabled on the irradiance map so we can see the differences from render to render. Okay, first step here is I'm going to add uh, the rectangular light. So I'm going to go to create spotlight and create rectangular light. So I'm going to go here and make a one by one rectangular light and then drag that vertically up there. So now if I go to perspective and I'm going to render. So here's the image that's uh, that results and you can see that we've uh, got our light coming through and we also have uh, some blurry shadows as well. If you'll uh, look in the reflection of our toys, we have just a little bit of that rectangular light there. So this is our, our base render, and we're going to go over here to our light properties, and all you need to do is have the light selected, open up the properties window, and then select light. So here are all the, the default settings that we have for our light. Uh, the one that we're going to look at right now is one here called No Decay. Right now this is enabled and will uh, cause the light intensity to be consistent no matter how far away from the light we are. Uh, this isn't actual a physical this isn't a physical property so we're actually going to disable that and what that's going to do is have our light change its intensity based on how far uh, away we are from the light. So without actually changing the multiplier of the light, I'm going to go back through and render again. And so here we can see that the intensity of our light is uh, significantly decreased just by having uh, no decay turned off. All this is is that at a certain distance from the light, the, the intensity is, is getting less and less. So in order to counteract that, we need to increase the multiplier of the light. So I'm going to go here and increase the multiplier to 30 and, and click render again. So now we'll notice that our intensity is much brighter, uh, which is good. And if we also look uh, rather closely, the intensity as we get closer to the light uh, is actually much brighter here. So I'm going to bring up our pixel information. And so right here, we're about uh, 220 gray. And as we move farther away, that's getting uh, less and less. So here we're about 72. So that is the, the concept of decay in action. So the other thing is that there are several properties about uh, rectangular lights that are important to uh, how they work. So I'm going to actually come here and I'm actually going to increase the size of the rectangular light and we'll see actually what that changes within our render. So I've got the rectangular light selected and I'm just going to click scale and I'm going to scale this light probably about two or three times bigger than it currently is. Again, you can go ahead and render and so there are several things we'll notice. First of all, our scene is uh, much brighter, but if we also look at the shadows, our shadows are significantly softer now that we have the uh, larger rectangular light. So we can control um, the sharpness of our shadows and also understand that we need to adjust the intensity of our light based on the size of the light that we're making. So, I'm going to close my frame buffer, undo my last action to get the light back to its original size, and then I'm going to scale it down so that we can, again, see the results um, 
in the opposite opposite situation. So render again. So again, we'll see that we're much darker now, but we're also getting uh, significantly less soft shadows. So rectangular lights have a great deal of control um, with that. And we'll also notice that compared to before, the highlight on our material is smaller too because the light is smaller. 